SEM has come out as an SBC. We're going to show you how to grind it in today's video. We've got ourselves an 83 squad of bronze, a silver, an 85 team of the week, an 86 team of the week, another 86 team of the week, an 87 team of the week, another 87 team of the week, an 88, an 89, and two 89s overall. So not too bad. We have got ourselves some new SBCs today as well. We've got ourselves an 84 times 7. I'm going to go ahead and open up this pack first, but to show you the requirements, it's one team of the week and an 83 rated team. Now, if you didn't know... With the team of the weeks in particular, if you've got yourself an 85 rated, you can actually go ahead and drop in a load of 83s and 82s into completeness. So let me go ahead and do that and I'll be right back. So as you can see, we can actually only put in three 83s and an 85 team of the week and the rest can be 82 rated. So now you know that while you're doing picks and going through this process, you can get these 84 times 7 done. So let's go ahead and open up one of them and see what we get. Now we are looking for high rated fodder, of course, but don't forget this icon is there for two months, 60 days and team of the season starts next Friday as well. So let's open up this 84 times 7 and see what we get. It's going to be a gold. It's going to be... Oh, oh, that's Harry Kuhl. No? So we got a hero there. We'll take a promo. Let's go. Is it the good one or the worst one? It's the 89. It is also a double walkout as well. So let's see what else is in this pack. Come on, EA. It's going to be Modric 87. So that is a very good start to this video. What else is in this pack? Let's have a look. An inform. And then we got ourselves a couple 84s and, of course, an 87. Now, depending on the situation of your club is what you do next. Now, with these 84s, especially if you need a team of the week, they are going to be perfect for doing the Team of the Week SBC. So I'll make my way over to the 83 Team of the Week. We need two 84s and an 82 rated team. So we've got those two duplicate 84s. I switched them over. If you have a look there, the reason being is they're going to be on this list ready to go in. So there they are. And then with the beautiful thing about these 84s in particular and an 82 rated team, we can actually just go ahead and put in a load of 81s. So I'm going through the step backwards at the moment. So if you are looking to do this from absolute scratch, I will cover that in a minute in this video. I'm just going through the steps at the end. So you guys know how to grind it at the end and you get to see some of the packs as well about me having to basically keep pausing it, build the SBCs we need and then come back. So at the moment, all I'm doing is adding in these 81s. And as you can see here, the 81s have been added in. And that's going to be an 82 rated team. So you only need two 84s and two 81s. Oh, sorry, two 84s and the rest can be 81s. And now the reason why we've done this, because not only do we get packs back as well, we also get ourselves a little bit done towards the team of the week. And then we have this 87. Now, this is really contextual in your situation. And what I mean by that is, let's just say you don't have anything else to put an 87 in. You've got SEN, you've got an 87 rated team on here, but you don't have enough 87s to complete it. He is untradeable duplicate and you are stuck and you don't know what to do. Should you discard it? Should you put it into a pick? What should you do? Now, there are several options. For example, with this, we need an 85 or higher. That's what I'm going to do, but you can go ahead and put them into the exchange if you want to. So we are going to go ahead and put Modric into this. And then what that means, again, instead of an 83 rated team, we can basically put in a load of 82s and 81s and get that SBC done even cheaper. Now, that all came from the 84 times 7 To get those 84 times 7 packs and other packs that are available for objectives, you're going to have to grind the player picks. Now, if you're new to the channel, you won't know what I'm talking about. But if you've been on the channel quite a lot of times, you'll know exactly about the system and the method to go through. If you guys want to join the Discord that is in the description, you can ask questions in there. You can speak to other people who are also grinding it and much more. And like I say, don't forget, Team of the Season does start on Friday coming up. So we've almost got enough for the team here. So let's go out to 83 and just see how many 83s we need to put in. So 183 does it. So perfect. With an 87, we can have all 82s and 183 for an 83 rate squad. And now we've got ourselves our first team of the week. This team of the week is going to be essential for completing SEN and any other SBC that you want to do. So let's see what we get out of this. And as always, we're looking to take the highest rated, which is going to be this 85. So it isn't the most helpful to start off with with the higher ones, but you want to repeat that process as many times as you can. Now we have this discussion, the 81 double or the 81 player pick. Which one is better? Now, in two days, this goes and it will come back again on Monday, today being Saturday, and we'll get a different pick. So what I'm going to go ahead and do here, and I opened up 50 of these in the video if you want to check that out. I've got loads of walkouts, but no special cards. So in terms of pack weight, they haven't been the best. But with these player picks in particular, we only need one rare and the rest can be common. So it honestly depends what your club is like. If you don't have many rares, but you have a lot of commons, do the picks. If you have quite a lot of rares and commons together, do the 81 double. So we are going to do both for this video to see which one's better in this video. So here's our first pick, an 83 rated. Shouldn't be too hard to beat. Now we're going to go back and do the 81 double. Now the difference is the requirements as mentioned. Of course, we need to have ourselves five rares. So we are going to go over to rares. 
go low to high, and we're going to pop in any ones that we have. Now, if you want to be extremely efficient with this, you should be doing your league SPCs, but I'm not going to cover that because you don't really need to do it. And as you can see here, we've got our five rares, and then the rest can be commons to go into this. So you need 11 players, five rare, six common, whereas the pick is eight players and one rare, seven common. So in terms of cheapness, that's how it works out. But then you can also argue we get two players instead of one, but you can pick one. So honestly, it comes down to your own personal preference, which one you prefer more. For me personally, I actually prefer the picks because I can choose which cards, whereas the pack is solely down to pat luck. Before we open that 81 double, though, we're going to open up our two tradable packs from the team of the week SBC we did. Now, sometimes you get lucky and get special cards in here and everything else. Sometimes you don't. So we did in this, we got ourselves three silvers and three golds. These golds can go into any upgrades you want. The silvers, I'll show you where they go in a second. But the more you do with these, the more players you get back, the more upgrades you can do. So it's a nice cycle in that in itself. Is that going to be Modric? I hope so, but I probably won't be, knowing our luck. It's not as Kovacic. But again, four players to go into any upgrade we want, four silvers to go into the upgrades, and then four bronzes as well. Now, I'm just going to pop all these up onto the transfer list to pretend that we don't have them. I do this all the time, so I have a lot of duplicates. And I'll show you where they go after this pack. So let's open up an 81 double. We have to beat the 83. And right there is my exact point why I don't like these 81 doubles. So we got two 81s for 11 players. They are both duplicate as well. So now what that means is we're kind of stuck not being able to open packs and continue the grind on. Yes, it's the same for picks. But the difference between that and picks is with picks, you can open up picks as you go through and don't have to stop. Whereas those packs, you have to stop. So again, we're going to go to gold. We're going to go to newest. And we're just going to pop in those two most recent cards. I know that they're supposed to be, um, for example, one rare each time. If you have loads of commons in your club, do one rare per pick. It's the most efficient way to do it. If you don't, then put both rares in. But because I'm in a situation where I'm lucky enough to have a lot of commons from doing the exchanges and that, I'm going to have two picks. That's how I basically run through the club and get through all the picks and that. Every rare is one pick if it's 82 or lower. So we've got ourselves our first pick here. Let's see what we get. And we get ourselves an 89 Sala. The reason why I prefer picks more than anything else. So this 89 Sala is really good to have. Luckily for me for this video, he is tradable that we had as a duplicate. So that can go towards the first step of an 89 rated squad for your SEN. Or if you have him in the same situation as I mentioned with Modric, you've got loads of duplicates, don't know where to put them, and you've got like nowhere else to put them. So what I mean by that is say you've got an 87 or an 89 Salah, you don't have enough for an 89 rated squad, and you're like, well, what do I do with this card? Then that card would essentially go into an exchange, which I'll show you where that is in a second, and much more. Once we completed this player pick, I'll show you what to do with bronze and silvers. If you do have any questions or you're a little bit confused, I'm trying to explain this in the best way possible, but it is really difficult to fit so much information into such a small video. But comment down below and I'll try and get back to you. But if not, join the membership program. That's going to be your best way. And I didn't recycle that duplicate because I'm stupid, but we got another pick anyway. And we got an 84. So again, an 84 and an 82 or an 81. We're actually going to go ahead and do another team of the week pick. But I want to show you what you should be doing with your bronzes and silvers to get more gold starting from scratch. So you should be going to do bronze pack method. And with the bronze pack method, they are going to go into the premium bronze. Give you the silvers to go into the premium silver. That's going to give you five commons. Do this one twice, and that's going to be one player pick where you need to buy one rare. Now, of course, we have the daily bronze and silver. We go on about it every video. That's 24 bronze and silvers back for two bronzes, two silvers each time. And then we have the daily gold. It's going to give you 44 golds back, 40 commons, four rare. Once they're all gone, you then carry on doing the same process with bronze pack method, but into these two, as I mentioned. And that's how you're going to get on your way. Now, I've got an 84 to deal with. And an 81 rated team. And we already know from in this video that two 84s is going to be enough for an 81 rated team overall. Because we've done it in the previous one. So again, our, for example, Carrasco and Muller can go in. And then we are just going to look for the 81s that we had most recently. And I'm pretty sure I need to switch this now back to newest. So every time I rotate them around, they go to newest and you don't get stuck. So I'm just going to go ahead and complete this SBC off camera. And I'll be back once it's done. So that has been done and our duplicate 8 to 1 has finally been recycled. So again, we've got another pack and you want to do those steps I said about bronze and silver to get more picks. Now, it's essentially better to grind as many picks as you can for the reason when you get an 89 rated Salah or whatever happens in your situation with your club. It's best to play it by ear. So we get ourselves another pack here from the team of the week. Let's see what we get out of this. It's going to be no one crazy. So again, that's four more bot golds to go into an or three more golds to go into an upgrade. Three more silvers to go into the premium silver to get five more commons back. So that is going to be your best way of grinding picks and getting more picks. 
Now let's go ahead and use the example where you have yourself a walkout, but you don't have anything else to put it in. You don't know what to do. So I am going to go ahead and use Sala as an example. I know you're thinking, well, that's silly because I've got enough. But just for the purpose of this video is why I'm going to do it. So with our Sala here, we're going to put in an 89. That's going to give us 51 players back. Now with these packs, it is possible to get icons and heroes out of them, walkouts and team of the weeks. I've done it plenty of times. People in the Discord who are a part of it have also done it. So it is really possible to do. If not, you've got yourself at least five picks here. So we get Dutch, center back. So we got an 86 walkout my exact point. It's only an 86. But again, that can help us towards SEN that we got from recycling the car we didn't use. We've got a load of 82s and 81s that we can use for the team of the week picks. And then every other gold you see here can be used for a player pick 81 plus or the doubles depending on what your preference is. So as you know, I've got myself at least two picks here with the duplicate because I do the rares like that. But we should have three to four rares, oh sorry, three to four player picks back anyway. So I'm just going to go ahead and make those four player picks off camera and I'll be back once that is done. So those four player picks have been built. We've also recycled those cards back round. After I've opened these picks, I'm going to show you one more method to get really high rated fodder. Now, as you can see, not every pick is going to be amazing. You are going to get some 81s in there and some 82s. So you will have to keep grinding this process round and round and round. The more efficient you are with it, the better off it will become in the long run. I should take that 83 as well, but I don't want to duplicate because I want to show you the last method of getting high rate of fodder as we get an 85. Now, 85 is an interesting one because let's just say, again, you could put that into a team of the week pick, which I'm going to do. But if you didn't have enough goals to do the team of the week pick, you can go ahead and put her into the exchange and get seven players back, which, again, you could get a walk out of it. You could get a special card. You could get anything else depending on your pack situation. So it is something to consider while you are doing that as you go through. Now, let me go ahead and build this last team of the week pick, and I'll be right back once that is done. So that has been done, and as you can see here, we have four 83s, and the rest can be 82 when you have that 85 in. So in this video alone, we've managed to get two team of the weeks to go towards SEN, and now we are going to go ahead and show you the last method to get really high-rated cards into your club, as we get two 87s and an 85. So let me take the non-duplicate. So that's going to be fantastic for SEN with the 88-rated squad. Now, of course, you can get your packs from objectives and get loads of packs from that, but I'm not going to show you that. I'm going to talk about evolutions. Now, it seems to be a lot of people are sleeping on these. Now, if you are not doing evolutions and you don't care about them, there are quite a few evos out that you can do. For example, the silver one, any 74 rated silver you can see on here will become 90 rated. The same for the second silver as well. You can get this done twice. Any 74 rated will become 90 rated. So that's two 90 rated cards. Then on top of that as well, we have the Silky Defender. And any 86 rated gold card, for example, can be 91. Or an 85 rated gold card can be 90 rated. So right there are 90s. Only do the free ones if you're not going to use them in your team. Unfortunately, some of the other ones have gone. But if you give it a little bit of time, EA will bring more out. And you can definitely incorporate those into doing SBCs you don't want. They're there for free and they're sitting there and you're not going to use them. But you need them for SBCs and much more. Why not go ahead and Evo the cards? Now, as always, if you do have any questions, comment down below. If you want to join the membership program to learn how to grind SBCs properly, that will be in the comment section. And join the Discord as well. And I will catch you in the next video.